welcome back to the series all about life skilling. My name's Teddy, and today I'll be showing you how to make a Balak's lunchbox to either sell or use for those cookboxes if you have the extra ingredients or just want to cook some up yourself. Not only can a lunchbox ingredients alone make millions, these are great for fishing, making these great to sell when there's fishing events going on in Black Desert. So if you're curious about the Balak's lunchboxes, let me show you how to cook them and what they can sell for. I'm out here in the Northern Wheat Plantation to start cooking up thousands of Balak's lunchbox, which I plan to use later on. But for those who want to cook these and have a lot of citron but don't know what to do with them there's plenty of options with the balax lunch box being a nice choice taking a look at the boxes they sport a nice plus 10 percent fishing experience negative seven percent auto fish time and plus two fishing speed for 90 minutes making this perfect for those who enjoy fishing taking a look at the recipe the balax lunch box requires two elton sandwich two citron juice and two citron candy those of you returning to the channel will already know i've been gathering the ingredients in preparation for this but for those of you who are new and don't know where to get the ingredients let me show you citron can be gathered using workers here at the maize Lens citron orchard and you can manually gather it cooking honey is gathered using workers here at alejandro's farm or xavier highlands here it can also be gathered manually at balanos Farms using a match lock as for the elton sandwiches be sure to pause here and check out the last episode where i've cooked up thousands of sandwiches already the link will be in the top corner or down in the description below before i start cooking i will make sure to throw on my plus four silver embroidered cook clothes for the experience and the canopy clothes as a must finally i'll be using the fun Fundamentals of cooking lifestone combination and a sharp alchemy lifestone. And before I get any angry comments, this is not going to be the best cooking guide or how to make billions in a couple minutes. This is just to show you how to make the Balak's lunch boxes if you choose or have the materials for it. You should just enjoy the game at your own pace, and I'm not trying to min max anything. Getting started with all the dishes required will be the citron candy. This is made using one citron, one cooking honey, and one raw sugar. I'll be making 9,757 and should be easy to do with how fast my cooking is. This whole process shouldn't take long if your cook time is low. If going for mastery in the mass cooking proc, this is going to take a while if needing thousands like what I'll be needing. This can also be bought for cheap on the central market, so if you're looking to sell these for millions, it's not worth it. When it comes to the citron candy and juice, these dishes are better used to make other dishes rather than selling unlike other dishes, but the end result should be nice with having more crates to sell, and it should give me another shot at getting the last cooking artifact needed. And I know, I should be making only Valencia meals, and I shouldn't be making any other recipe while cooking. With the citron candy done, it's time to move on to the citron juice. This requires 5 citron, 3 sugar, 5 mineral water, and lastly, 1 cooking honey. One thing I love about multi-dish meals is just the amount of witch's delicacy that can be gathered. It could be great for those wanting easy contributions or those trying to level alts. Speaking of alts, one way to do this is have your alts make all the lesser meals and save your main for the higher end meals frocking. But with that being said, this is not going to be the best way to level cooking nor is this going to make you the most money that you possibly can. This is just a you have the extra citron and again you should really stick to the valencia meals i know but speeding past all the boring citron it's time to start making the lunch boxes to see how much can be made and how many i'll have ready for guru boxes eventually i will hit guru cooking it will be a little bit from now but with all my cooking gear i see that happening soon really fast let me know down in the comments below how much cooking you do and how much time and money you've invested into your cooking gear while you're down there be sure to leave a like if you're enjoying all the life skilling content here on the channel jumping back into cooking and throwing all the ingredients into the pot, it's just a matter of time waiting for the lunch boxes to get done. The main course is where I'll make most of the money, and not just with selling on the central market or with the imperial cooking, but these can be combined with the oak pills to make the marvelous Balak's lunch boxes. These can sell for 9 mil each, with their main importance being used for AFK fishing. The marvelous grade is a nice grade if you do mountain of internal winter region dailies, but if you're just trying to make the most money without spending all the extra time, using the regular Balak's lunch boxes is the best choice. Because I tend to do a lot of fishing, these meals are great for it, and with trying to get the fastest auto fishing time. I was considered using the Madison instead for the increased mass cooking chance, but I think using all my buffs should take care of the missing 220 cooking mastery with the tri Manus cooks clothes provided. Doing gather and cooking, these buffs have been a godsend for me with not being lucky enough to get a tet Manus. With how lucky I've been this week, I'm not sure I want to try enhancing for a Manus for a while. Future me here. I know how I said I didn't have good luck, but apparently trying to record failing a tet tap I got one. So, hey, I got a Tet Manos now. Now, if only I can get my alt cook clothes enhanced. Luckily, I've made sure to keep my personal storage chest so when I hit the weight limit, I don't have to run all the way to Califion or use up all my maids. Cooking up a couple thousand can take up way too many maids and not enough time in between to justify using a maid up when I can save them up for something else. I have my workers gathering the ingredients throughout the week so I can make more Balak's later, but if you have the ingredients for the Valencia meals gathered, I'd stick to those personally, but these should make a nice amount 
amount if choosing not to buy the ingredients from the central market. With all the meals coming to an end, it's time to see how much they can make if he chooses to sell the lunch boxes. Here in Calfion, I can start checking to see the prices for all these. I wish we had an easier way to put things into the warehouse, but with the shared storage, I really can't complain too much. For the Balex lunch boxes, the total comes out to 326 mil, which is lower than the Elton sandwiches sell for, so keep that in mind when choosing to cook these. As for the citron juice, the blue grade will sell for 8.9 mil, and finally the blue grade candy will sell for another 7.4 mil. For those wondering about the delicacies, I was able to produce 308, which is able to get me one contribution point, which if you're usual here, you'll know I love my worker empire and how much I need the contribution points. While not making more money or being easier to make like the villain 2 or Balanos meals for example, cooking the Balak's lunchbox is a nice way of getting some cooking experience and some silver while doing it. It's not going to make you the most silver like with making the Valencia or Balanos meals, but does provide a different dish if you choose to make them. Like I've stated before, this is not going to be the best way to level cooking, nor is this the best meal to make the most money. This is just a nice way to show you how to make the Balak's lunchbox and how much it can make if you choose to do it. You should just enjoy the game at your own pace. But as always, if you want to see how to level those life skills or just want to make more money in Black Desert online, click this video here and I'll see you in the next episode. Keep gathering out there.